I'm in the north. The north? I haven't seen Utkash in years. Listen, there's a golden path cell there. They're good people. Utkash is just north of the bridge, and this cell, they know the area better than anyone. I'd appreciate it if you could reconnect with them, but be careful. You've seen the Royal Guard. They're tougher and smarter than the regular armed forces. They're waiting for you downstairs. Ajay, thank you for reuniting us with the Golden Path in the south. You can tell Amitha and Sabal we are ready to fight. They have targets picked. Look at you. A lovely couple to match a lovely home. Very salt of the earth. You know, I was told that if I ever wanted to experience the hospitality of Utkash, that I had to visit the Ranas. Oh, we questioned everyone, too. And everyone said the exact same thing. They are the friendliest. They will talk to anyone. To anyone, I said. To everyone, they said. Hmm. Well, they were so emphatic that I decided I had to see it for myself. <laughs> He's cute. You see, I, uh, wanted to warn you. Warn us, sir? Yes. Now, I'm not sure if you've heard, but it's come to my attention that there are some very disreputable people around. And I'm concerned that these people, these terrorists, well, they might take advantage of your hospitality. Maybe ruin your wonderful reputation. And we wouldn't want that to happen, now would we? No, sir. No. Well. Would you allow me to protect you? To ensure your reputation? Please, yes, Kingman. Your wish is my command. <laughs> I'm so glad we could agree on this. Well, I won't take up any more of your time. Uh, this should only take a moment. 
And they say I've lost touch with my subjects. No! They'll kill you! I'm getting pagan. Amita! I found Pagan! I'm on his heels! I think you could end it right now! I know! Did you miss me? Oh, wait, yes, you did. Pagan? I just killed you! No, no, you just ruined a perfectly good body double with hair loss. Do you know how expensive he was to make? He wasn't even Asian, for Christ's sake. He was from Melbourne, I think. His only crime was being born with fabulous cheekbones. Whose picture do you think's on the money? No matter what's done is done, I suppose next time it'll just be you and me.
Ajay, we're just in time. Pagan's broadcast is starting. What's this about? No clue, brother. But we're going to find out. Good people of Kirat. I'm sure you will all be delighted to know that the reports of my death are completely and utterly inaccurate. I am alive, and all is right in the world. The life brings change. And I implore you, Kirat, to look to my example and see it as the positive influence it is. Change requires strength. And it is a strength that I know all of you possess. Now, I recently experienced change within my own organization. Miss Knorr and Paul Deplor, after years of dedicated service, have decided to move on. I'm sure you will all join me in wishing them well in their future endeavors. But like them, we must look forward, not back. The attempt on my life is nothing more than a symptom of resistance to change. Rest easy. For Yuma Lao, my trusted commander-in-chief, who oversees our mining operations at the KEO facility, stands between me and any would-be assassin. She would rather die than see any harm come to me. Go ahead, I challenge you. Put her resolve to the test. <laughs> to summarize, change is good. Embrace it. Your king is alive. Rejoice. And Yuma stands like a sentinel, waiting. Bring it on. Sounds like he's calling us out. The mines. You know what to do. I've spent a lot of my life apologizing for Yuma's first impression. She has a remarkable ability to make consistently terrible introductions. I'd love for you two to meet on better terms. She really has been the driving force behind most of my successes. She forges deals with my international buyers. She uh, polices Noor and Deplur. She even finds time to run my army. Well, that is until her recent obsession with Kirati superstition took a hold of her. She thinks I don't know about the expedition she's been sending up the mountains looking for magical paintings or whatever it is. I'm as open as the next fellow about negligible losses for the sake of employee morale, but only so many pins can go missing from the stationary cupboard before someone has to lose a hand.
What the hell was that? They're in my Shangri La now. Like you to kill me after everything I did for him. Before your whore of a mother came along, he was fearless. Nobody could stand up to him. Then your mother. Your mother. She weakened his resolve. She turned him into this simpering shell of a man. He stopped being a king that day. He was broken. Weak. I lied to myself. I thought he would get better. He had to get better. But no. <laughs> what is broken stays broken. It stays weak. But Pagan will not break me. This country will not break me. And you, you will not break me. Huh! <sighs> uh. 
Your liberties for peace later. You can either get in line or get out of the way. You got me. What the hell? Let's stop playing this game. Shogwa. We both know what you really want. No toys in bed. Die, AJ Gale. Time to do what Pagan would never do himself. Time to kill you and mix your mother's ass in pig's law. <laughs>
Amira, you must dead. Oh, you killed the demon of Durgesh. Don't worry, Ajay. Bacon is next. 